Hello everyone, welcome to Techie QA channel. So in this video, I am going to explain how to do protractor testing. So what is protractor? So protractor, we will use it for AngularJS based automation testing. So if the site is made with AngularJS, we'll use a protractor tool. So uh, why can't we use Selenium? So if we use Selenium, we have to use so many implicit way to uh, load the data actually. So protractor element will be uh, loaded soon with angular js so the data will be uh, taking from the server and load it it will take some time to load so the protractor will handle it very smoothly for this uh, kind of situations so that's why we use protractor so and uh, there are some side you can uh, read about so what is angular js and how it's developed so get some basic knowledge about that that also will help you to well while, while you are finding the locators actually okay so how can we configure this so we are going to see how to configure in your laptop also the first thing you need is node.js so please install node.js uh, from node.js.org okay so here you can get it for mac os and as well as for uh, uh, windows everything you will get it other downloads so once you download maybe go to terminal type npm so there should be some response come like this if commands you got it node.js install and npm is set in windows also you should install and see the path where you have installed node.js so set the N, uh, npm path in the environment variable okay so once you've done this you have to install protractor okay so protractor see here is the website protractor test.org okay so now what you can do just go to home so you can see some sample project all these things so here i'm going to show live how to do it okay so npm install minus g i want to install globally so minus g protractor just enter it okay so it's downloading all the required things So based on your internet speed it will download as much as possible yeah it's done i have installed protractor 5.3.2 now what you have to do you have to check protractor is installed fine or not yeah so protractor installed okay so this is how we can install protractor and uh, there is one more thing what you have to do web driver manager dot update so you should update webdriver manager so what will happen it will update your selenium standalone as well so when i am saying selenium standalone protractor will use selenium server standalone server like uh, in backend so so we still we have to do script with selenium also so it's actually a wrapper class uh, they have written in protractor see it's updated jaco driver you can see selenium server so even you can see chrome driver here so whenever you run some command just see the response what's happening so in future uh, you will get to know what is the use of these commands simply don't copy paste and do just read about it so now what you have to do you have to start so once you start the protractor server is started okay so thank you guys so next video i will show you how to create a script with protractor please subscribe if you like it